Hello my creepy lovelies and welcome back to another cliffhanger tech story. This one is called Delete. Let's begin, shall we? Unknown says, I miss you. Jill says, I'm sorry, who is this? New phone. Unknown says, don't lie to me. You know who I am. No, I'm sorry, I don't. Did you delete me? Who is this? Great, Jill. You deleted me from your life and then your phone. I wish I could delete you. This isn't funny. Who is this? Who is this? You get to ask five questions and then I delete you. Oh my gosh, I would just delete this person. <laughs> what do you mean delete me? You'll see. Where are you? I'm here. I told you. I missed you. Here? Parked outside. Who is this? Come on, I know you like games. This isn't funny. Neither was how you treated me. Play. Five questions. When someone acts like this and they won't answer who they are, just go ahead and block them. And if they keep harassing you, then, I don't know, try to call the police or something. <laughs> what happens if I play? You figure out who I am. I'll tell you what I'm going to do to you. Okay. <laughs> who are you? Guess. Five questions. Fine. Good girl. Who are you? You can't ask that yet. Not in the rules. It's no fun. It'll spoil the game. Do I know you? Obviously. <laughs> you used to. You pretended to. Two. When's the last time we spoke? I reached out to you a few months ago. Don't you remember? No, because I don't know who you are. <laughs> it's just a game, Jilly. No need to get upset. It's not just a game. What do you mean, delete me? Keep playing. Number three. How did we meet? Through friends. If you can call them that, that's not really enough information. <laughs> what friends? Is that your next question? No. How well do we know each other? I know you intimately. I know every inch of you, creepy. I know the things you don't want people to see. I know everything about you. Mom? <laughs> You're creeping me out. You're not really outside. Look. See the SUV out there on the corner with the tinted windows? Crap. You like it? It's new. Tell me what you want or I'll call the police. And tell them what? You're on my property. No, I'm not. Public street. You're threatening me. Call. I'm calling them. I haven't done anything. Yet. And you don't even know who I am. They could trace the phone. I wouldn't do that. You don't know what I have done. Oh, what I have. It's huge. What the? Oh, I wouldn't do that. You don't know what I have. It's huge. Don't you want to know? That sounds disturbing. <laughs> you only have one more question. Take your time. I'll wait. What do you have on me? You have to play fair, Jill. I know you don't like doing that. You're lying. You don't have anything. I'm not the liar in this conversation. I was there. I know what happened. What happened? You called me crying. You needed my help. Then just got rid of me. I have no clue what you're talking about. You forgot me. I guess you have to keep guessing. One more question. Are you an ex-boyfriend? Maybe. Maybe. I'd consider myself one, but I know you don't like labels. Matt? Finally, that took forever. So you did think I was your boyfriend. How sweet. What do you want? I want you to know how it feels. How what feels? To be alienated from everyone in your life. To have your life destroyed. I didn't destroy your life. Seriously, what'd she do to him? I tried to call. Clear things up. I told you it was over. No, you didn't. You just told everyone else. All of our friends. I gave you a chance to explain. There was nothing to say. It was over. You told them I hit you. I don't know what you're talking about. You told them I broke up with you because I hit you. I know you'd never hurt a fly, just like you won't hurt me now. You can't just throw that around. That's a horrible thing. I never said that. I lost my job. What? I work with kids, Jill. It's a small town. I'm sorry. How could you lie about something like that? Things weren't working out between us anyway. That's how you justify it. <laughs> you told Kim, and it spread. I just told her you punched a wall. Because I was upset about after the accident. I know. So you lied. It was awkward. I just wanted to move on. You didn't let me move on. They misheard. And you didn't correct it. You didn't defend me. I don't remember the conversation. Were you drinking again? No. Were you drunk when you talked to Kim? I don't know. 
When you drink, accidents happen. Stop. I loved you. I tried to protect you. I fixed your car. I fixed everything for you. What do you want me to do? Who do you need me to talk to? I'll fix it. I'll tell them you're harmless. You can't undo what you've done. Once your reputation is ruined, there's no going back. What do you mean? I'm done covering for you. What are you going to do? Show people who you really are. How? I have a photo that doesn't leave anything up to the imagination. Your friends, family, boss, your boyfriend, they'll see. What photo? You'll see. I bailed you out a lot, so I guess there are multiple options. You don't have anything. You want to test me? I've known you for a long time. One click. It goes out to everyone. I need you to delete the photo. I thought you said I didn't have anything. <laughs> you know I don't lie. I was a different person. I'm better now. I've been meaning to call you and explain. You sure you have? <laughs> don't lie to me. I'm sorry, Matt. Why? You know why. I need you to say it. Or in this case, text it. <laughs> I'm sorry that I disappeared. I'm sorry that I didn't handle things the right way. What else? I'm sorry that I lied, that I started that rumor. I loved you, and you ruined my life. I know you don't want to do this. Don't tell me what I want to do. I want you to know what it feels like to be deleted. You think your new BF is going to stick around? What do you mean? He won't be able to handle it. He can't handle messy, Jill. I could. Whatever it is, Adam will understand. Not this. He won't understand this. What is in the photo? It's cute. You still kept the same password, by the way. What do you mean? For your email. My email? Oh, I forgot to mention. I'm sending it from your account. Let me come outside. I left. Where are you? Sitting in front of my computer. What's in the photo? It's really a striking image. You'll get a lot of great emails tomorrow. Will you just... Will you just say what's in the photo? Gosh, annoying. Please delete it, Matt. Too late. Sent. Jeez. Crap. Unsend it. You can only unsend seconds later. How do I know you sent it? You could just be messing with me. I'm done messing with you. It's done. It's sent. What was it? Why don't you check your email and see? I can't get in. That's too bad. It still doesn't work. I wonder why. You jerk, you've changed my password. I wouldn't want a retraction. I'll change it back first thing tomorrow morning. After everyone is settled in with their coffee. Checking their email. Then you can watch the responses roll in. Boyfriend doesn't know about us, does he? Who'd you send it to? Everyone in your contact list. Everyone? Everyone will know who you really are. Tell me what's in the photo. I don't want to spoil the fun. Tell me. You owe me, Matt. You broke my heart and my life. This is exactly what I owe you. Sweet dreams, Jill. The next morning. Did you check your email yet? Why? Did you send me something dirty? Haha, <laughs> nope. A love note? Later. Babe, if you get something from me, it's spam. Don't open it. Okay. Someone hacked my account. He sent out a virus. That sucks. How do you know it's a he? What? The person who hacked your account. I don't think we should get into this over text. Babe, you're being weird. <laughs> Are you okay? Just please don't open it. Okay. What's going on? I was hacked by someone I know. Why? Who? Remember that guy Matt? The weird guy who fixed your car? <laughs> weird. He's more than that. Can I call you? Why didn't you pick up? I can't talk right now. My boss is in the next cubicle. Okay. Um, remember I mentioned he and I were hanging out when we met? You and I? Yeah. You were dating this guy? Not really. It was casual. I needed a reason to end it. I feel like Adam is an Adam. Because it is weird he didn't answer. I know he gave an excuse, but still it's weird. And I met you. Okay, you didn't tell me that. I mentioned him, and now he's hacking into your account? Why didn't you lead with that? I didn't want to get into it. How do you know it was him? He told me. 
He texted me. Why does this guy have your password? I don't know. We were close. You said it was casual. Can we not get into this? Just don't open the email. You talk to him. A little. And why is he doing this? I don't know. Liar. <laughs> when I ended it, things got messy. You never told me that. You said you never dated. It doesn't matter. He's just a confused guy. He sounds crazy. Babe, you should call the police. No! It's harassment. I don't want them involved. I'll call them. Do not call the police. Adam, I'm calling you. I don't want to talk. Just don't open your email. Why are you not answering? <laughs> Too late. I just did. Don't look at it, please. We have a firewall at work. That's not why. There's no viruses there, Jill. What does it say? Adam? It says September 4th, 2017. I did this. Did what? There are two photos attached. Don't download them. I didn't have to. They opened. Why'd you lie? What? About that Matt guy. What's the photo? Which one? Were you with him? No. We were together September 4th. I wasn't with him. There's a photo of you kissing. Is that it? No. Oh, this is disgusting. It's probably an old photo. Not that. Who is Janet Miller? Crap. Jill, who was she? Why? It's in the email. I don't know. Don't lie. I've never heard of her. It's in the email. Tell me what it says. It wasn't Janet Miller's fault. It was mine. What the heck is going on? I don't know what he means by that. And the photo is probably a fake. It's a pretty good fake then. What's the other photo? A car. A squished car. And the other? Him kissing you inside your car. That's not me. It's you. I know it's you. You texted me later that night. I told you I hit a deer. Right. And you said your friend Matt was helping you. He's good with cars. He did a good job fixing your car. What are you talking about? I can see the damage. That's not damage caused by a deer. I need you to tell me the truth. He's lying. If this guy is lying, I need to know the truth. It wasn't me. I need to know what happened. We were together then. Were you seeing him? That's not important. You want my help? Tell me the truth. Yes. Sort of. I hadn't ended it yet. You told me it was nothing. I needed help. Why didn't you call me? Because I knew he could fix it. I could have fixed it. I was scared. You and I had a fight that night. I remember. So I went out. Don't blame this on me. I'm not. I just didn't want you to be mad. So you called him? His dad is a judge. He knows people. Who? Why does a judge care about a deer? I was drunk. I thought you stopped when we met. I lied. I lied about him. What do you mean you lied about him? He knew my secret, so I discredited him. I lied about everything. What secret? Who is Janet Miller? She's the woman I killed. Adam? I can't do this right now. I'll call you later. No, I can't do this. I think it's best you delete my number. Oh, jeez. That's how it ends? I mean, she, you know, you want to know more. It's like, okay, well, so what happened now? I mean, does she go? Does she get arrested? Or, or do, does she, like, try to fix things with Matt for whatever reason? Does she try to fix things with Adam? Like, wow, it can't just end like that. Does she get fired? What? Okay, well, I think that was a good one. I hope you guys enjoyed that one, and I will see you next time for another cliffhanger tech story.